it takes time. In Isaiah chapter 42, verses 18 to 20, it says, Hear, you deaf, look, you blind, and see. Who is blind but my servant, and deaf like the messenger I send? Who is blind like the one in covenant with me, blind like the servant of the Lord? You have seen many things, but you pay no attention. Your ears are open, but you do not listen. This was a time when Israel was sinning against God and they didn't make the connection that the bad things that they were going through was because they decided to be disobedient. I'm going to reread verse 20 because that's the one that sticks out the most to me. You have seen many things, but you pay no attention. Your ears are open, but you do not listen. There were times in my own life where I was seeing, but I was not paying attention. And I was hearing, but I wasn't really listening. I was wondering why I was going through the things that I was going through, which were not good things. It's only when I took the time to spend with God that I was able to understand. Sometimes it was an attack from the devil and sometimes I invited the devil into that situation by being disobedient to God. My encouraging scripture, which is also going to be proof that God will reveal his thoughts to us is actually going to be in Amos chapter 4 verse 13. It says, He who forms the mountains, who creates the wind, and who reveals his thoughts to mankind, who turns dawn to darkness and treads on the heights of the earth, the Lord God Almighty is his name. The last thing that I want to say is God will reveal his thoughts to us. It just takes time.